Hi there everyone. Here we back here for another episode of Space Engineers in our crushed red ship on the moon with Pirates World. And in the last episode we found some uranium, started mining that, which is quite nice. And we also um, discovered that um, it uh, takes quite a long time to mine uranium now, even with an elite drill and it's also very very hard to spot it's very hard to spot um, at least visually so without that, that without that ore detector it would be in quite a bit of a spot of bother trying to see the uranium so flying past asteroids not not as easy to spot as it used to be so for some reason I've just had a huge frame drop but uh, yeah, oh, there's our uranium. Anyway, so we're going to fill up the ship. And that shouldn't take too long. And then we'll journey back to the moon. And uh, drop all that stuff off. And we'll have a nice supply of uranium. And then I can start working on uh, either the base. Well, maybe both. Do a bit of both um, together. Um, finish off the base. Uh, the outpost and um, also build myself an ion mining ship. Now there is a design I do like and it's one of my old designs, it's called the Zip Miner but I got some friends who um, I used to well, used to play quite regularly with and they love the miner but the, the, I think they're getting sick of it because I build it every time. I mean can you blame me? You stick with what works. <laughs> so I'm not actually picking up anything. Oh, I picked up one. Oh, I drilled through to the other side. Oh well. Let's pick these up. Uh, hello? Thank you. Yeah, not a fan of this graphics card, I gotta say. Um, so yeah, really, I'm starting to get desperate to get, to get a replacement, but um, it's just that factor of money and not having a lot of it. <laughs> Some ore just stuck right in front of me. So, this will take some time. Did you see, yeah, I saw one over there. There he is. And some there, there, and there, there. Oh, some more here. I think I just passed through a piece of it too. Alright, we're full. Let's head back. And back to our trusty wasp. Wasp. <laughs> back to our trusty, trusty wasp. Okay, so we hit I and put that into the connector. So only a couple more loads. I don't even know if I'll uh, fill up the cockpit. I might. But yeah, we really gotta just keep doing this. And it'll be great once I can get a proper mining ship. Got an unknown signal. So we've actually had quite a, uh, a little bit of good fortune actually throughout this um, playthrough. 
So, yeah, whoever... Um, still can't get anyone to join me, though. It's been really, really difficult. Um, I don't know, is it me? <laughs> yeah, that is a dig at you guys. Uh, both to my friends Tom and Fifty. They've been playing on a server though, so, and as I've stated, I'm kind of over servers. Really, um, now that we've got the de decorative pack, um, I'm a little bit over mods, to be honest, as well. Because um, I just, I don't know, with, once you get that decorative pack, I guess mods can be nice, but, yeah. I think I'm over it all. Oh, well, that's about to go out to the outside, so we'll just keep drilling into this section. Drill lots and 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 lots. Any more? There's got to be more. Ah, hello. Is that one? Yep. Yeah, as I say, really hard to spot them. Um, let's see. Any more? What about under here? No, nothing there. Ah, hello couple hiding from me and my full. So we'll head back out this way. There's the trusty wasp. Back we go. Putting some more uranium in you. So yes, we have quite the supply now. So I want to, yeah, I want to head to that hole again. Get some more of the stuff. supply. I mean, with the stationary base, the good thing is, I mean, at the moment, that thing won't be chewing very much power at all, so this should, this supply should be more than adequate. And then, once we get our miner going, that thing's going to chew a bit of uranium, so we'll have to, um, Make sure we come back out here once that's done. Okay. And the mine is also going to be handy for uh, getting a lot of ice. And now that we've found a whole ice cluster, I don't need to bother so much with heading to the south pole of the moon, which will be great. And uh, yeah, there's some more over here. Up, oh, more there. Pick you up, you up. And you. And you. And you. And you, and you. Is that it? Nope, there's more. Um, we're nearly full. That's, oh, I'll grab this. Now we're full. Heading back out of the hole we dug. In case you couldn't tell, I'm very happy we found uranium. Very, very happy. Oh, we get some more. 
You know what, I think I'll just fill a connector. And then we'll head back. In the interest of uh, saving time. Wait a second. Energy low. Oh, okay. Gotta head back to the ship again. Hello, lovely. So charge up. And how? Speaking of uranium, how is our ingot situation looking? Rather good. Very good, in fact. So we've got 10k in our cargo container. We have a roughly another 10k in the connector, and we could put about 8k. Yeah, eight. Yeah, about 8k in the cockpit if if I wanted to. But um, I don't think I'm going to do that. Ah, this one. So we'll head back after probably this load. So do one more lot of drilling. And that should do us. Alright. So drill some more. Do some more drilling. I'm like one of the seven dwarves, but in space. And if my suit runs out of energy, I'll freeze to death and become Snow White, literally. <laughs> Do you like my singing there? I thought it was great. You know, I'm known for my singing and my modesty too. Oh, stone, yuck. I want that though. Uh, dude, actually, did I pick up some stone by mistake? Yeah, I did. Get out. Get out. Don't want you. Nobody loves you. Not anymore. Although stone is a bit more useful now with the um, survival kits, which is great. Um, and I had thought about putting a survival kit on, on the base, but now that I... Oh, God, I wouldn't pick that up by mistake. Oh, well. Had thought about putting one on the base, but now I've got the refinery, uh, the large refinery and assembler. And now that we've found a good supply of resources and their locations, I don't think it's really needed anymore. It might be on the uh, wasp if we decide to take it. Oh, stone. Uh, if we decided to take it down to um, the Earth like planet, maybe. It might be a good idea. We've got a private sail incoming. Oh, there you are. Thought I saw you somewhere. Um, no, I saw another one here somewhere too. Hmm. Oh well, I'm going to go dump this stone out here. Just so it can get out of my sight. Filthy pleb stone. And... Ah, there's some. And I'm getting bitten by an ant. Go away, you little bastard. Ah. Oh, there's another one. And here's another one. And there's another one. Another one. And is that it? You know what? That will do. So, let's get out of here. Let's blow this joint. What is that? Business shipment, okay. So we'll put you in the connector, and then we'll put the rest in the cockpit. Because, uh, you know, I like traveling with uranium in my cockpit. 
And yeah, see the passenger seats have got rammed too, so I could always put some uranium in there, but I'm not going to this time. So we're going to head home. Now that I've found these sources of uranium, I can always come back later. So, let's find where home is. Home is that way. Which is good, because it's almost right on that horizon there, right on the edge. Which is great, actually. Now, it is 53.44 kilometers, though. So, yeah, we've, we've travelled quite a ways just to find uranium. Anyway, let's turn our dampeners off and get ready for blast off in three, two, one, fire! So we're up to full speed now, heading back home. And those pirate raiders, I think we might actually pass within, I don't know, will we pass within their range? We'll soon find out. So now what I can do is I can get rid of that temporary marker I put up, we'll delete that. And actually, what I can also do is I'm going to hide the rest of these. So, turn that off, turn that off, turn that off. Just to clean up the, the HUD a bit. I'll even turn the ice cluster off. Don't need that anymore. Unknown signal. Let's turn that off. And it looks much better now. So... Heading back with two days of power. And that is battery power though. And what we can also do is let's have a look at our ice because we would have burned a little bit of it. And we'll pop that in there. Pop that in there. Then hit ore. And pop that in there, just to empty it a little bit. So this is going to be a long flight home. But, totally worth it, since we found uranium. I do like these cockpits. I mean, that rubbish crap that people are going on about um, how they're unfair or whatnot. It's just like, go away. <laughs> they are not unfair. How are these cockpits unfair? Like, they they don't even have a large port on them. So I don't understand the logic with that. Um. Apparently they're a bit more robust from, from videos I've seen they're actually not So I don't know I don't get it So it'll be good to be home and it'll be good to uh, have some uranium to refine and We do have a substantial amount as you can see at about 20k So that will get us quite a good supply of power. And these shadows are pissing me the fuck off. <sighs> Look, I'll try putting the resolution back up because this only started happening when I turned the resolution down. So I don't know. I tried to tweak a few things. But it's really, really bad. Like this. Why is it doing that? I have 
no idea. So even if I go into first person... Well, hang on a sec, now it's not doing it. What the hell? Okay. Um... I don't understand, but okay. So if we go into third... Yeah, it's back to doing that again. I wonder why. Oh, well, just so I don't kill people's eyes, I'll go back into first. Just until we get close to, closer to home. Like we will get in range of those pirates because their approach speed to that is getting slower and slower. So if we look up, yeah, we're passing underneath it. So that's pretty cool. That's annoying. Well, looks like we're going to be flying in first person for a while. So that wasn't too long a trip actually. So going well. Should be hitting the gravity well pretty soon though. So what we'll do in anticipation of that, we'll go to control 2 and turn off our rear thrusters. So that way, once we hit our dampeners, we should keep coasting along. Kilometers, nearly, now it's six. I should be able to see it. There's the gravity well. So we hit our dampeners on. There's our tower. Ship's still there, which is good. Need to go back into third. Oh, yuck. Hit two. Hit two now.
So we do a bit of weight. Not too much though. Our thrusters seem to be handling it. Excuse me. Now only one thrust is firing. What the hell? Have I mentioned I hate this graphics card? So line up the middle of our spotlight. This gives us a good indicator of where our connector is. Be right, yep. There we go, and we're down. So now we can lock. So we go to control one and lock. There we go. So if we have a look at our resources. It's all being drained, all the ice. And the medium cargo container is taking out all of the uranium. And we can leave it connected there for now though. So if we hop out, look, the horrible flashy flashy shadow thing is gone. So if we go into our inventory, Look at our refinery. And we have uranium. Producing. Now this will probably distribute it. Um, so if we go to ingots, um, uranium. Uh, yeah, it's putting it into the small reactor and to the base reactor as well. So it'll put them into, well actually it's putting it into the base right now. So that's fine. And uranium will take a while to refine, but for the most part, it's um, well. The base doesn't need a lot of power at the moment, so that's not going to be really an issue. Okay, we are getting a little bit of that shadow thing, which is annoying, but uh, not much I can do about it. Alright, well, we are coming up to exactly half an hour, so I think that was good timing. We made it back safely with a supply of uranium. Very happy I found a, a source uh, to mine, and it is indeed rare, as they say. Um, so the rumours are true. Uh, uranium is now not impossible, but very, very, very hard to find. So, um, yeah, I wish you all the best of luck with... Uh, your your travels in finding uranium, and if you don't have much success, uh, again, I put out the offer for everyone. Um, just leave a comment below if you want to join in the fun and uh, help us you know, build a base, take on the pirates. Um, that would be great, and uh, I really look forward to it. But um, as usual, it's time for me to end this episode, so as usual, take it easy, and bye for now.